everyone and welcome back to a new video and today we'll be, discuss be discussing the different eras of Ninjago since Ninjago's anniversary has already commenced and it's an it's its anniversary month I'd like to do a celebration of that and go through what I call the different eras of at number one we have the pilot to season two now these seasons well well special and the season is basically the first era of Ninjago. Why I say this, there's only like a special in two seasons here, is because um the pilots and um season one and season two were the first era of Ninjago. That's where it was actually supposed to end. Like the writers actually wanted to, the the creators and writers actually wanted to end Ninjago then, because they felt the story was over. But many fans were like, we want more Ninjago, so we got more Ninjago. So that's going to leave us to our second era, and that's era two. These, this era is season three to six. Now, I know this might be controversial, because many people think that the second era of Ninjago is season three to seven, but I think it's season three to six. Why? Well, Ninjago was at its peak this time. There are many fans and many people enjoyed it, and many people actually knew of the show, and many children were growing up with it, and it was a really fun time to be a Ninjago fan, and many YouTubers were coming into the fandom, so yeah, that's a good thing, and yeah, that's basically it. Alright, now on to Era 3, the Dead Era. Ooh, Era 3, the Dead Era. This combines Day of the Departed, the movie, and Season 7. Now, many fans do not like all of these projects coming that came in 2017 and 2016. Many fans actually hated this and still do today. And um, uh, for me, me personally, I think I'm mixed on all of these, honestly. Uh, Day of the Departed, it's extremely mediocre. But it's just, yeah, mediocre. That's all. The movie is okay and had amazing animation. It's the most amazing Ninjago can look. So, yeah, that's what I think of the movie. And uh, Season 7? <clears throat> season 7's animation sucked, but it did have a great story, and I really liked it. <laughs> I know this might sound goofy, but <laughs> for a time when I was re-watching Ninjago uh, in 2022, early 2022, I thought it was my favorite season. I know, I'm sorry. Insert this goofy sound effect. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I liked it, okay? But... I, it, it's not my favorite season anymore, honestly. It's a good season, but it has bad animation. Now, Era 5 is the Oni Trilogy. Many people think that the Oni Trilogy is actually the best tr the best thing out of Ninjago. Now, I think it is too, actually. These are one of the most perfect seasons I've ever seen. One of them is my favorite season, which is Hunted. And one of them is what, like my second favorite season, which is Sons of Gumbardon. And March of the Oni, well, it's the odd one out. Like, the phrase third one's a charm, it's not you. Like, to Ninjago fans, this is one of the, honestly, uh, March of the Oni is honestly one of the worst seasons for them. But this, I think that March of the Oni is pretty decent. It's nothing amazing, but it felt like, really like a movie. It should have been the end of Ninjago for me. So, yeah, that's basically it for Era 5. Now, this era has recently ended. This is the sixth era in Ninjago. And we call this the Wild Brain Era, since it has new animation. And I think the animation is the best Ninjago has looked in a long time. Many think people think that Wild Brain animation is bad. But have you seen Crystallize? Have you seen Seabound? Like, have you seen Master of the Mountain? Those seasons look amazing, especially Prime Empire. It has okay animation, but the lighting is perfect. And the lights, the colors, oh, I want to eat colors. I want to eat the bone. But don't mistake the colors for being animation. Okay, guys? It's Colors are not animation, all right? The sixth era, many people are mixed. Like, season, season 11 to 14 were perfect seasons, honestly. But season 15, Crystallize kind of ruined it. It really ruined it, actually. And it had a terrible ending for the characters for this era, and I really don't like that. But still, I'm high hopes for Ninjago United. That's many. That's what many people think the title is. I don't know. I'm not sure, but it might be. So that's it. 
I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Sorry for the notifications popping up. Uh, there were Discord notifications. Sorry about that. And I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye, guys.